Hello, hello, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for Wednesday, February 20th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, doesn't the date really doesn't even matter. Okay, this is just a message I'm picking up for somebody who needs it. That's all there is to it. So let's just see what comes up. There we go, that's a good start, isn't it? We're gonna take them too because that's just who I am. Walking away? No way. Yeah. All right. Somebody is walking away. Walk going down a new path, right? Deciding it's time to go. Because I appreciate myself. I'm jealous of what everybody else has. And I know that this is a great big world, right? There's a great big world out there. Somebody is like, I'm in search for love. I appreciate myself. I deserve to be appreciated. I'm walking away. I'm going down a new path because I want what everybody else has. Now, you think about the world card. That's a completion. It is. It is. I'm completing this chapter. I've learned my lesson. I've learned my lesson that if I want what everybody else has, I have to go get it. So it looks to me like somebody has is being or seeing they got this new vision that once they go down this new path they're gonna they're gonna get to the spot where there's love patience taking that journey absolutely ooh taking action that's what's happening here somebody's been stuck for too long trapped like a numb but it looks to me like it's time it's time to go it's time to get unstuck it's time to speak up it's time for change it's time to make that choice to break this 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 bond or whatever this what would you call that bound she's bound up tied up it's time for me to speak up. All she has to do is open her mouth. Her mouth isn't covered. It's time for me to speak up. Five is about change. It's time for a change. It's time to accept. It's time to make this choice to, to speak up for myself because I want change. That's what we got here. Somebody is taking action. I mean, it's clear. So here for today's message, somebody's taking a journey. They are. Somebody is crossing that bridge. It's time. It's time for me to cross that bridge and leave behind everything that doesn't serve me and not take it with me. I know that I have multiple, multiple options ahead. So I feel like we have somebody here that is making a decision. They have went through a period of reevaluation. They have said their prayers, you know, and their prayers are kind of like being answered here. I think that they are being guided. And I said that because we have this one right here. They are being guided, you know, to go down that new path, to walk away, you know, to let themselves heal, to appreciate themselves enough to open their heart and give their heart to somebody who appreciates them. So I feel like somebody has been sitting in the sidelines, just waiting for somebody to come rescue them, thinking, you know, that they could, uh, probably they put a name on that rescuer, you know, this person's going to come rescue me. The fact of the matter is, is that the only person that can rescue you is you. And that is by speaking up for yourself, standing up for yourself and, and, and untying yourself from situations that keep you trapped. So I feel like somebody is deciding to really cross that bridge, to really cross that bridge into the unknown. I'm leaving this um, grave situation behind because I want what everybody else has. I have to. I have to step outside of my my grievances. I have to step outside of my own shadow 
to my own darkness. I have to step out of this this spot. I have to actually take that journey on my own. I have to take action. So I feel like somebody here is is about to break free. Okay, run free, one run, run wild. It's like I I just want to be wild and free. I want to be wild and free. I don't I don't want to be trapped here anymore. I don't want to be trapped in this circumstance. It's time. It's time for me to travel. It's time for me to go. It's time for me to um, manifest the love that I deserve, where I will be appreciated. So I really feel like somebody is really walking away. They're heading in a new direction. They're traveling to a new destination. The time is now. You see the clock? The time is now. I think that somebody has went through a period of healing and now they finally love themselves. Now they finally appreciate themselves and they know what they're worth. So I feel like somebody is, after they have been through a period of waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting, it's time. It's time to just be happy again. It's time. It's time for me to, uh, like I said, step out of the shadows. It's time to step out of the shadows and go after what I so much desire. Somebody has been just watching, you know, seeing all the happiness around, just um, keeping themselves stuck and saying, no, I got to go, I got to go, I got to go, I got to go. You know, and I know I said this the other day, but that's that's the way it goes. I feel like somebody is, is swiftly headed out. They are moving very quickly. And I feel like on their journey, wherever they're going, that probably somebody is gonna is gonna they're gonna run into somebody that you know is wild and free just like they are okay this person may not be your usual type they may be of a different culture they may be of a different color but it looks like there's uh there's some kind of chemistry here so i feel like there is probably um these two people could run into each other you know something could happen and you can't get away I don't know what that means, but I also feel like somebody is leaving behind um, something that kept them stuck. They're leaving it behind. I'm leaving that behind. I'm leaving that victim mentality behind. I am. I'm not I'm not bringing it. I'm not I'm not a victim. I think that's what it this is. It's like I feel like somebody has been divinely guided with the angel of love. It's it's like you you know when once you love yourself to break free of this whatever it is mentality, you know, that you're a victim or that you're stuck. Once you break free from that and you you live wild and free and you just run free and you're taking action you know, they're going to bring you in that love, but you have to take that journey. So I feel like somebody is really about to cross that bridge. I mean, really cross that bridge into the unknown. It's like, I'm ready to leave it all. I'm ready to leave it all because I just want happiness. I love myself and I want love. So I feel like somebody has just pretty much decided it's it's time to turn my back on this situation that has kept me stuck i mean that's what we got here somebody is walking away from a situation that you know they allowed themselves to be stuck in they didn't speak up for themselves she could have she didn't have to stay there for by any means everybody knows that women women know how to holler every, every woman does so there's there's there or a man i mean whatever we all know how to scream, holler, and yell. So everybody does. So this was a self-imposed uh, prison, okay? Somebody is walking away, walking out of prison. I'm walking out. I'm leaving. I'm leaving this situation in search for a better life, a better, a new beginning, okay? The world card is ending, a new beginning. So somebody is headed in a new direction, and it's going to lead to victory and success because they speak up for themselves, so, yeah, I mean, what more can I say other than I feel like somebody has decided that it's time to go down that new path. The time is now. They have been divinely guided that it's worth it. It's worth it. If you want this happiness, you have to love yourself enough to walk that path, to cross that bridge, and to leave all the everything else, everything, everything behind. She's not taking much with her, okay? She's, she's leaving it. She's leaving it. She's not taking much. She's leaving all the stuff. It's like it's like that quote I have on my refrigerator. The best things in life 
aren't things. And that's, it's love. The best things in life aren't things. The best things in life are love, is love. So I really feel like somebody is headed in a new direction. They're taking swift action. They're moving quickly. It's like, you know what? I'm out of here. <laughs> out of here. Let's get a couple of these. I think it took a good good uh, amount of time, though, for somebody to appreciate themselves and love themselves enough to you know, go after what they want. That's what I think. I think somebody just couldn't break free. I'm not sure why, but somebody couldn't break free. And now it's like, it's time for this to end. I mean, the world card, the, it's, the, it is, it, this is an ending. An ending that brings about a new beginning. It's time for me, for me to complete this chapter. One phase of your life is over. One phase of just sitting in the shadows and waiting. I'm taking action, baby. I'm not going to sit in the shadows. I'm taking action. I'm not going to be stuck here. Goodbye. I mean, that's what I see. Walking, well, turning my back on this prison I have stayed in. Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So they may be bringing in a new love, especially right here with this angel of love. There may be a new love that comes into your life because you move away. You walk away. When you And you notice where I put the card. When she gets to the other end, she's going to attract the love. They're going to bring it right to her because she left behind what didn't serve her. So whoever this is for, somebody is leaving behind something and they're walking right towards love. That's what's happening here. Because they decide to appreciate themselves. They decide to be happy on their own. You notice this one's alone. I'm happy. I'm good. And when you get to that point, when you're, when you're at ease, when you're at peace with who you are, there it is. So somebody is headed right towards love once they make that move. Let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others. Don't be afraid. The people that love you will support you. And I feel like today is a day of walking away, taking action, heading towards love. And that's what I see. Crossing bridges. Did we... You saw it fall out, did you not? I hope to God you did. Because how many times did I say crossing bridges? Crossing bridges. Son of a gun. I can't even get over it. I can't. Um, <laughs> I, I shock myself sometimes. Crossing bridges. It's time for healing, connecting, mending, and releasing. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. Crossing bridges is a way to let go of the past. And I said it with this card and this card. Amazing. You see where I put the card? I can't get over this shit. I cannot. Anyway. Crossing bridges is a way to let go of the past and begin a new cycle in life. A heartfelt change is ahead. Heartfelt change. I can't even get over this shit. I'm sorry. A heartfelt change is ahead. It's time for healing old wounds with people and situations. It's time to forgive and let go of the past. Do whatever you need to do to make amends and then let it all go. If there is anything unresolved in your life, take steps to re restore and reconcile, even if you don't, you know, really reconcile. You may even need to burn the bridges behind you. 
Heal the rifts within yourself. Oh my God. Help others traverse bridges in their lives as I'm doing right now. When the traveler crosses a bridge, a new land awaits on the other side. I can't. Thank you, God. That's all I can say. Thank you, God. When the traveler crosses a bridge, a new land awaits on the other side. You are ready to cross a bridge or bridge a gap in your life. There are times to step away from certain people and situations. There are also times to carefully mend bridges with people, situations, and places, and then go forward. This is one of the most powerful healing times to choose. Maybe there is a wound inside of you that needs to be forgiven or accepted. Transform the inner grievance. Oh my God. Forgive, let it go, do it now. You no longer need to carry it with you. Perhaps there is a person from your past with whom you should reconnect or release completely. You know what you need to do. The time, this is the time to do it. And remember I said the time is now. I just, I totally summed up this reading with this card. Do it now. Follow your heart. Your heart knows what to do. Some of you will not. Okay? That's why those monkeys are there. Some of you will not follow your heart. You will not. You will continue to be stuck. But the majority of you that are w awakened, you know what you need to do. Good luck.